Hi again, it's Jared in Houston. And when I installed a wet wet dry filter on this tank, I had to use the uh, clear siphon tubes right here on the back. And one of the biggest challenges I had with these clear siphon tubes was keeping the air out of the lines. So you can see I've modified those tubes to uh, keep the air removed continually. What I've done there is I've uh, drilled a small hole in there using a Dremel tool and I, I was cautioned about doing that because the, the, the plastic will, will crack. If you're going to attempt this you might want to consider having a spare tube on hand on the off chance that it cracks but I recommend using a Dremel tool uh, and then I, I put that clear fitting on using a, 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 a hot glue gun I installed that clear fitting and then the tubing and then I've just got a simple little T uh, bringing those two together and that line runs down into my sump or to the uh, aqua lifter that's the aqua lifter dosing pump right there runs through there goes around the top of my uh, wet dry there and then and then inside the the box and you can see the end of the line there I put it right up against the face of the tank so I could see that water is in fact uh, running down into my wet dry filter. So I've had this running now for about uh, two weeks and it's it's been very good about keeping the uh, air out of the line and and if in fact you do lose power these, these tubes will in fact uh, uh, lose all the water but when the power kicks back on and the pump starts running again uh, it'll quickly and efficiently remove the air from the lines. Um, as always with these siphon tubes be careful and cautious because if you do something wrong you can make a, a big mess. Uh, but I wanted to share this idea and I hope it works for you as, as well as it has for me. Uh, thanks to John and Tracy on the fish box for this idea and their helpful suggestions. And I hope if anybody else has any good ideas, they'll share them with the other people at HoustonFishBox.com. Thanks.